is a train. Great train tracks with Tim and Joy. Okay, so this is where our adventure starts. It ends at Murdoch, but we're gonna walk to Macca's probably. Let's go. Woohoo! Oh, I'm gonna zoom out like that. Hang on. Do you guys know that this was actually built in 1888? What? The, Dad, that's how hot, that's how old my mom is. The railway tracks. I might as well just document it to the camera. These railway tracks were built in 1888 for uh, supply reasons, like to de deliver supplies, and they used to go all the way back there. Um, then it shut down in 1981 and became the tourist railway, which is, well, no, it shut down in 1981. Three years later, they turned it into the, the tourist railway, which is the tracks that are now existing. It's all right if you walk in these. I can't, like, switch because you have to pull the lever for them to switch. You can't just, like, switch over. Unless it's computerized. Nah. You know the um, signals for like the level crossings? Yeah. They're actually not computed either. They're like old fashioned wired style. I'm pretty sure. I mean, I've walked this track a hundred times with Jazzy Kid. Jazzy Kid? I remember walking this track once. No, I've walked it twice, but like with my, with my dad. We walked it like three years ago. <laughs> All right. Like only like 10, not even. These sleepers are so elevated. Look, they like elevate. You know what? What? He's a fascinating thing. What's a fascinating thing? When you wear a backpack empty, it feels lighter than actually having the backpack on you. Really? I know. <laughs> it's weird. Alright, uh. So trains should be running today as well, so. Don't get run over. Tim's all. It's good to know if you start. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes it goes like 20. This is still so elevated, but they get down to the ground later because I've walked this track several times this month, but we're going again. Sleepers are still elevated as you can see. But we've still got a massive journey, boys. Keep it up. What's Tim got here? Also, guys, welcome to my first video on this channel. Bro, this kid's got axed. Kid got, brung his got camera. Got kid got in, uh, injured in soccer today. So he'll be walking like a grandma today. No, grandpa. Grandma's kid actually walk properly. Feeling that it is at Muradoc, oh. which is the next station. You can tell the train's been here because shiny like, rails. I look like a tourist when I. Oh, <laughs> See, when I was here and the rails were completely rusted with Flynn, the trains weren't running that day. As soon as the trains run again, it just scrapes all the top rust off. So the trains have been here already. Oh, on, I just heard the horn. Look, yeah, I heard it. But you know, your mum heard it from Polly, so. Yeah. It might be far away. No, it's far away. Yeah. Because train horns are loud as hell. I just heard it again. Keep walking. If a train comes now, we'd have to go through the thorns and go up there. So it's like, hurry up! No, let's get in closer. And it's at the level crossing with the cars. Close. I'm getting to the side. Yeah, it will go around the bend. Then we'll get hit. That scared me. Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting to the side. Go, go to the crossing. No, it's no. the one where it's going around the bend. Yeah. yeah. There's a train. Oh. There's a train. Oh. If it honks, I'm gonna shit. Same, I'm gonna shit myself if it honks again. It's so loud. Wave, wave, wave. Woo! There is a train. Please don't honk. It's gonna honk. It's gonna honk. No, it's empty. It's 
Yeah. Train conductors are so nice. The sick moment, it's gonna come back. It takes like 15 minutes though. Yeah, so we'll probably be able to get to the second side of the level crossing. See, what's really good it's 19 degrees is that train conductors and like the drivers and all that are so chill about you just walking on the tracks and almost killing yourself. All right, guys, so I'll see you when either the train comes back or I just need to show you something for this video here like a little kind of level crossing um it's like a it's like a level crossing but for people so train wheels go through that so there's like a level crossing for human activities biking anything like that more facts you don't need but this is made out of train track probably made in 1888 when the train, when the tracks were nah, built. Like yeah, it would be something like that. I don't know why it's, it's white now. Crossing, it looks like new paint. Yeah. So there is a level crossing just over there. Um, so yeah, the train is most likely probably going to come in another, I'm going, if it was there, go to turn around, give the passengers like a break just to walk around. I reckon we'll get to this little like pickup station over here and it will be kind of coming back. Uh, that's what it did last time when I was walking on these with dry. Um, it, we actually saw it further back though, so who knows. Being a photographer. Say hello to the camera. He recently played soccer and got like a little bit of an egg, uh, egg <laughs> leg injury. So he's not walking too fast but he can still walk he's fine so if you guys want to actually walk on these train tracks um the start of the tracks are on watts road and yeah watts road and there's a station in muraduck but uh you're not you're better off really yeah you're better off walking starting from mornington and watts road because that station just isn't busy I think maybe, I think the best is starting from there. Yeah. So super good. But then like here you get more adventure. Yep. We have, it, this is not uh, the Muraduck station or anything. This is just a, another station. It's an abandoned station because that used to be the ticket machine. Though. No, it is the ticket machine. They can, they actually stop and pick you up here if you're on it. That is the abandoned station just over there. This is just a second station where they, oh look, the train's coming. I can see the light. Oh, Here comes the train. Nice. Yeah, those are good. Oh, those are good trains. Awesome. Right, I'm gonna get off in case they stop for us because I think we're wanting to get off. Okay. There is the train. The train is coming. The train is coming. There we go. There goes the signs. Yep, it hogged. There it is. Yeah. The rails, if you look over, when we're walking on them, if you look over the rails, aren't actually that straight. They're pretty wonky. Yeah, it's vibrating the ground. Train is here. I was expecting that, I was expecting that. Should I go for a high five? Yeah, no, no, no. Oh, That's so good. It's uh, it's letting the diesel fumes out. I can smell them. Cool. We've also got a level crossing right here, as you can see. But we're gonna take the little. Normal yeah, safe. thing. Traffic, so that's yeah. Why it's yeah, yeah, they have to stop the traffic, so they're all coming through now. All the cars. 
So yeah, we have to make a little detour. It's not much, just like a hundred meters on even. Yeah, in the movie. Um, that we never made. So we're back on the tracks now. We're gonna hit the track. These sleepers are just old but nice, and then he's just got this one. That is a sticky note. That is. Wait, Padua. Toilet, toilet pass. pass. <laughs> <laughs> it's a toilet it's pass. Wait, show that to the camera. Amali Dwyer. It's, it's, it's D Dwyer's. No. Yeah, alright. All right, Whoever Marley blah 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 is, we found your toilet pass. They have toilet pass at Padua. It's so Really? Bad. That's stupid. We've got another little level crossing here yeah, for walking. And there's a neutral ground And then he just went into a house. This is the mansion, too. No, it's really long yeah, the mansion goes until like almost the next level crossing. Uh, that's another train that's track really made. Nice. Oh, no, I can't bother investigating because we've already seen it so many times. But I'll show the viewers. There is the mansion right next to the train tracks. So, a little update. There's a turn just there. I know it's at the turn. I've walked these tracks multiple times. But there is also an old sleeper here with an old... 1960 beer can, which is not made in 1960, it's just the brand. And there's also another sleeper just there, as you can see. But we've got to walk all of this, and then after this there's a level crossing. Well, not after this turn, there's a couple more turns, and there's a level crossing. And then we're at Murduck Station. I'll give you guys just a little look through at Murduck Station. Then we'll get to Peninsula Link Tunnel, and then Peninsula Link Maccas, and that's where our journey will end. Let's go, let's come on, let's get a move on. I'm here. Uh, I never know what this is. I think it might just be a sensor. But no, we found out that they actually pull the things, you know, the ding a ding a ding things. That actually goes down. Yeah. No, these ones don't. Those ones do. No, they don't. Oh, they don't? Yeah. Oh, they do. Um, so I don't know what this is for. It might just be like a sensor for the rails. Or it's a pipe for housing. But as you can see, it does hook up to the rail. So. Unless... It hooks up to the rails unless when the train goes past that, it gives the people that turn the signal on like a warning, like, get ready. Okay, we we'll get you a frozen Coke when we get to Macca's. That is the, um, thing. The level crossing is just there. You probably see the cars moving past. Uh, we, can, we usually cross this road because it's not busy. Huh? Man. I think a footy game must be on at the Oval. Yeah. I think there's somebody on the tracks. Yeah. Okay, we're at a level crossing. There's somebody walking on the tracks with a dog, so I feel like if you know, if you see a dog, you're just like, well, they're fine. But we're at a level crossing here. Cars are going past. Gonna get hit by a train. But, let's go. So, I don't know why that person was going slow. Like, he didn't want to get hit by a train. If a train was coming, you'd want to go fast. Um, let's cross. Cross, how are energy levels feeling, Tim? Quite low uh, for me. Really? I'm, I'm not bad. Have I saw my energy? Hang on, boys, we've got some cars coming. That side's good. They're stopping. Oh, they're stopping. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, and... Viewers, here's another fact. So pretty much every train track in the world is made out of wooden sleepers or concrete. Those are plastic. Yep, it's made out of like, you know, milk bottles and all that. Like recycled? Yeah, recycled sleepers. Actually, these ones might be concrete ones. Uh, yeah, that's plastic, yeah. I know there are plastic ones up here. <sighs> There's the Muraduck station. It is open. No, I think it's closed. No, it's open. It's open. But the train's just stopping there. The train isn't coming. It's just stopped there getting ready. The train station is closed, I think. I can see the fence. So it must close at like three, I reckon. Because we saw it go past. And it takes forever to actually get here. So yeah, I think it's closed. But we'll still like peer in through the fence. Okay. We have got... They're probably just practicing. Uh, this, um, see, they still use the old wire style for the signals. 
instead of computed. I think nowadays they usually computer it. So we're pulling up to the station. It looks look it looks so far on the camera. But then it's like probably only that far away in real life. Which is three times zoomed in, but normal zoomed in. Looks so far. <laughs> Every time we go here we always check out this hell of uh, this hole of hell. I don't know where it goes, like the rocks just, just go. Alright. To the train tracks. I mean to the station. I mean whatever. The path since the uh but we always take that path no matter what. I'm just gonna give you guys a little peer in. There's the trains. Uh, you can see the diesel train that was used today and there's also another diesel train just over in the corner But there's also a steam train. They even put this here so you don't like mess with the wires Put that there so you step over them steps Nice steps generic homeless styled steps We made these we made some steps Oh, uh, yeah, this is the only muddy bit you just have to walk on these old sleepers that they put here and these uh, these are prickly bushes actually, not like thorn bushes, they're just those really prickly ones that prickle for some reason. So Tim, uh, you see that? Like those hills right there? They were most likely dug out by shovels. Yeah. What they have here is a T uh, B11 uh, diesel train and a K163 steam train. I don't know what the other diesel train is. I think it's like a W something. But you can see if it focuses. There's the steam train right there, that green one. It's just like backwards. W two four one. Oh, I was I was right with the W. It's a high beam. So that, that's high beams. They just go along the tracks making sure everything's it looks okay. So cool. I'd love to discover them. We've been in there, we had to sneak around because we didn't know it wasn't we were actually allowed to go through there, but at the time we didn't know, so we kind of snuck through. Either T11, I think it's T11 or it's TB11, or maybe even T411. No, T4. Yeah. Let's have a look what it is. Yeah, it's, T4. yeah, it's T411, okay. The coal that they use. Uh, yeah. We could probably take some home. I already have enough coal at home, but. There we go. This is where my brother got my Christmas present. Um. Okay, I don't really want to take any because it actually costs like a lot of money to get coal. I only take it if it's on the tracks, like it's fallen out. Because then, like, what are they going to do with it? Pick it up, use it. Um. There's the T four eleven, and then there's the station. It is closed. It must shut at, I reckon, 3 o'clock. It is like 3.20-something. I want to show you the tunnel. It's in the abandoned section, so keep watching, because, um... Yes. Tim just asked me what that is. That is a 75-foot long turntable. Oh, a turntable. Yes, turntable to turn the yeah, train around. Drive thinks Baxter's down there, when Baxter is just across the tracks. Yeah. Um, I don't know why he thinks it would be down there. If you, you just gotta keep following the tracks. But yeah, that's a turntable if you didn't know. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna give you guys a top view. I haven't seen the top because you're not allowed to climb on it, but I'll get a better view from over there. Probably here. But I can still reach over and give you guys a nice top view of the turntable. So there it is. There's the turntable. That just like. Trains go on it and then turns the train over. You should know what a turntable is. Uh, oh, you can't see the K steam train because it's covered by carriages, which really sucks. You can see the back of it. The bit that we saw was actually the back of it where they keep all the coal, not the front. Because that would be a really weird looking steam train that if that was the front. Some, some of the old transport carriages. Yeah, that's. Yep. Yeah. This is the weird thing. This line is abandoned, like this bit of the line. But they haven't actually paved over the rails, as you can see. They've just left them open. Like right there on the road. Yeah. So they should they usually pave over the rails with concrete, like road concrete. And they haven't. Which is what they usually do to abandon lines. Just crossing because it's safer. Um 
And there's also like more track in the middle there, but it's a bit Yes. We could probably just do it now. This, the car was coming now, but we could have done it. It is now abandoned. So the rail used to the railroad used to go over here when it was like in 1888 to 1981, but now it's just the tourist railway. That's the end of the normal rail. It's all abandoned. Uh, I, I wouldn't recommend walking through it. It's pretty thorny as you can see. So we're going to take this little path. So here's the tunnel. Yeah, the all the time. Yeah. Do it pieces in all the right way. They're all empty, so we're not oh, vandalizing. Yeah. yeah, that's the one they were doing when we came. I mean, yeah, I mean, it's trespassing, but I gotta admit, the tags, like, they're not bad but it is illegal, so. Okay, and then there's the tunnel. Just goes, so this is abandoned actually, because you can see, look how rusty that is. It's a bit spray painted, but you know. So yeah, this is just all abandoned now. Well, it's been abandoned all the way there since Muradark Station, so. Okay. Um, This is, I'll just stop here. We're not at the top top, but you just get a, if the train came, if it wasn't abandoned, this would actually be such a good, like, sick angle of the train. There's, like, no grass growing on the actual track as well. So, here's a fact. This bridge was actually built with the peeling, because they were like, if we reopen this track, it won't be as much work. If So, they built the bridge for this train track. So, if they ever reopen the track, uh, they just got a bridge right here instead of having to redo the whole train track. And then closing down the bridge. Okay. Yeah, this is insane. This is at the top top. So we're gonna head down now. Get to Macca's. Let's go. Spray paint at this top. Yeah. That's still so sketchy though. Like if you fall. They're risking their life for the shittest tags as well. Like look how shit those are. I'm gonna go head down now. This was fun. This was a fun adventure. I'm gonna go to Macca's. So that includes our adventure, drive found a glove, but that is it for our adventure oh, okay. along the train tracks. Uh, we're just gonna get some Macca's from over there. Pin the link. Uh, if you guys wanna walk on these train tracks, even with us, contact us on the comments or just- Contact us on uh, 043499. <laughs> Uh, yeah, but if you're gonna walk on them, I recommend starting from Mornington because starting scenery, from scenery, scenery. Yeah, starting from Muraduck is just a bit odd. So, I and mean, you can still start. Could you not, please? Why? Because you spray painted the community tunnel. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll regret that. So, yeah, that includes all adventure. Hi, Kim. See you, Timmy. Yeah.